Uh, Ohara School was established in 1895 in Japan. And also, we have four chapters in India and two study groups in India.、Uh, I think、uh, the main idea of Ikebana is less is more and making a negative empty space、uh, emphasize or make、uh, materials more beautiful.、Oh, I think、uh, using more、uh, flower materials than branch materials. Because、uh, recently in Japan,、uh, it is difficult to get or gather branch materials, and now we need to think about or change our mind about materials. And also, we have to consider about the size of the ikebana, because、uh, recently our house b e c a m e very smaller, smaller, smaller. So we cannot、uh, exhibit the big. Arrangement in Japan. So、uh, now we try to make Ikebana、uh, make the size smaller. Yeah, of course, we can use technology with Ikebana demonstration.、Uh, and I think the technology gave us a, a new method or new idea uh, about uh, to demonstrate、uh, Ikebana in public today. Today,、uh, I, will, uh, then I will make、uh, four, no, five, 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 five arrangements. Today, we are celebrating our 33rd anniversary of the Delhi chapter of Ohara School. Now, normally, 33rd is not a very special year, but we want to celebrate our 30th year. And unfortunately, COVID overtook all of us, and headmaster also could not make it at that time. So, to make up for lost time, we have him now on, in our 33rd year, and we are very lucky, very privileged that a headmaster of that caliber agreed to come to, with,、uh, to us. He came in 2015 also, and that was for a short while. And this time, he is really enjoying his trip here and looking at all the flowers that are blooming away in, in, in Delhi. Now, when a headmaster comes, Then we always feel that he is going to show us something which is very traditional, very typical of the school, because that is what makes the difference between one school and the other. So, though we look forward to his uh, various uh, demonstrations with technology and you know,、uh, containerless Ikebana, but this time he is showing us typical Ohara arrangement. I used to arrange flowers uh, uh, at the Imperial Hotel in Tokyo, the s o g a t s u But I regret that I have never learned Ohara r y u But I had the privilege of welcoming the headmaster, Hiroki Ohara, to my residence the day before yesterday. Today, I am honored to be invited to this auspicious occasion to commemorate the 33rd. Right, 33rd anniversary of the establishment of India branch of Ohara Ryo. I would like to learn Ohara Ryo Ikebana from now on. The art itself has a deep connection with Indian culture because Ikebana started with Buddhist monks. And Buddhist monks, when they came to India to study Buddhism, they took this culture of offering flowers to God. And that went to Japan and developed into a full form, full art form. Flowers are living, so live things. When you are interacting with them, there's a very good energy and it's a meditative art. So that's why those who start practicing, they love it. It gives them a lot of happiness. 
essence of ikebana i would say that god has made one thing one person of one kind only there is no other person like him or her and there is no other flower like one particular flower so the individuality of the flower each flower has to be shown to the maximum